Hi, welcome back. We're um, continuing the series of uh, building the Dave Gingery uh, milling machine as outlined in this wonderful little book. Well, today the, um, I'm showing you the cross slide. Now, the, um, the cross slide is mounted on the ways and we'll mount that way if I remember right. Um, the pattern itself is uh, a composite pattern and um, when I say composite it's a number of small uh, it's a number of pieces so uh, <coughs> a base a base plate a strip there and then narrower strips there. This provides the cast, this gives the casting the, uh, the steps required for the, um, the fitment of the ways and then the clamps, the clamps on, along these tops. Uh, this by the way, I, um, I've added material up here by mistake, thinking the height of that wasn't going to be um, tall enough. Um, if anything, it is. It has to be lower, slightly, by a few thou, and I made it uh, higher. So um, this casting, far from perfect. By the way, this pattern is a you know, three-piece pattern. So that's the drag half, and then these two are the, the coat pieces. They are the nails. The nails need to be uh, re-glued back into position, but um, it worked. It worked. So you notice it's marginally lower than the thickness of the ways plate. That allows then for another one by a quarter, not two by a quarter, to go over the top and then the adjustment of the ways is with shins on these surfaces. And then there's a, a gib a gib that gets fitted in there with three or four gib screws to provide adjustment on the ways. So this pattern, uh, this casting didn't turn out as good as I, uh, I would have liked, but um, it's good enough to use. It's a bit rough on that surface. I had to file these down to uh, bring them up fairly good. It's uh, been bitten off a bit along those uh, edges. Uh, a bit of a hole there. A bit rough along that edge there. But not and truly good enough to use. If I'm not eventually happy with it, I'll recast another one and then machine it in this mill when it's finished but at the present moment uh, I'm going to work uh, work with this I think it'll be okay it, it actually sits which way that way that way I think it sits that way anyhow that's uh, that's later on so There's a, in this particular one there's a lot of um, filing to be done, so these clamp surfaces have to be right, the ways surfaces have to be right, again the clamps and the ways, uh, they've all been filed and uh, scraped, and um, the, only, the only problem the only pr uh, problem I, um, I found was, uh, well, it's not a problem. The dilemma with this is, 
uh, is will the work table be 90 degrees to the ways. Now, Dave, Gin Dave Gendry mentions in his book to check that later on, after I've done all this, to check that on the, uh, the bedways by putting the work table, by the way, these work table plates are massive. What were, were they? I um, can't remember now. 18, 19 inches? Um, no, I can't. Well, that's the. That's the carriage anyhow, so I'm not going to, I'm not going to find it there, that's the piece I'm doing. 19 inches, 19 inches, that, that's to go across, look at, look at the size of that compared to the, to the base. Um, gee, I hope it's a rigid machine, <laughs> I hope it's a rigid machine, but we'll make it. But what he says is with a square you make the work table piece 90 degrees to the ways. You can do that with an accurate square, that's, that's not a problem. You then clamp that down and then using and then bringing your uh, carriage carriage in this way with with another uh, work table length fitted you then measure the distance between this correct uh, plate to your carriage way well it's not a way so measurement across there and measurement across here. It's over 19 inches, so uh, you, you should be able to get this down to a very, a very accurate 90 degrees to the bed way. Well, I hope so because it needs it needs to be. But uh, I don't uh, I don't see to see a problem with that. Now to get that. To adjust that angle requires the filing of these clamp landings to bring this way to 90 degrees to the bedways. That'll be interesting. That'll be interesting. Um, like I said, if I'm not happy with this, I'll make another one, but uh, I will persist with uh, with this fellow. Um, again, it takes a fair bit of work uh, to do it, but I notice also that there is a, it will be out because there is a slight amount of misalignment of this side in relationship to 90 degrees of on this side, but as uh, as the book says, you file the clamps to bring it around around square to the table. So that'll be uh, further down the track, and um, this must be a uh, would be a short video. I. Um, Thank you for watching and um, we'll catch up on the next episode. Thank you.